morning all. It's officially my second week in India. It's Saturday. Uh, it's about half past 11 now, so I've just come out for a bit of sightseeing. Uh, I'm off to find my way to the rugby club this afternoon, um, so that, that should be quite fun. Um, so I'm not straying too far from the hotel. I uh, need to give myself a bit of time this afternoon. Uh, so I've just come up from the Bell Road to MG Road. Uh, you can probably get that by all the noise in the background. Uh, two things I want to show you this morning. Um, I'll just pan across to the right hand side. You can probably hear all the honking horns. Uh, well, it sounds like the Bangaloreans have had enough. So there's a little mini protest uh, going on this morning um, about the horn and the, the noise pollution. So let me just pan around. Here we go. Yeah, so there's a, yeah, it's a full scale protest. We've got placards. Um, there's probably a probably a quarrel there in terms of number of people protesting. Yeah, there's about 20 people I can see here. Not really having much effect on the horn noise, I don't think, not just yet, but uh, Rome wasn't built in a day. Uh, so the other thing to show you, a little bit of history, just panning around quite fast here. As I said, I'm just on the fringes of Cubbon Park. And the first thing I can see here is the statue of Queen Victoria. Um, I can just about read the inscription. Uh, that's only because my eyesight's so bad. Uh, it says Victoria, Queen of England, uh, no, Queen of Great Britain and Ireland and Empress of India from 1887 to 1901. Uh, erected by public subscription 1806. No, 1906. That's better. Unveiled by His Royal Highness George Frederick Ernest Albert, Prince of Wales, Duke of Cornwall and York on the 5th day of February 1906. Excellent. Okay, so just panning across to the right hand side now. Look like some uh, further into Covent Park, some quite well-kempt gardens. I'm going to head in that direction and uh, no doubt some more footage soon. <laughs> 